Too many thoughts on my mind, I can't sleep at night, so I just keep writing. I don't need no help, I don't need opinions, so don't waste my time then. I just been living online, my city don't show What's going on guys, O King back here with another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys which guns are like very OP on this game and which you should use all the time while playing this game. Um, the beta does end today, August 6th. It will come back next Friday, or this Friday coming up uh, for that weekend for PS4, Xbox, and I believe PC players. Um, so let's get right into it. Alright, so the first gun I have is the Cordite, probably one of the best submachine guns in the game in my opinion. Um, the fire rate and accuracy, as you can see on the right side, is like a god tier. It's like honestly one of the best matches you can have in a uh, submachine gun. And if you did play Advanced Warfare at all, this is basically the submachine gun of the BAL. The BAL was a, a assault rifle in Advanced Warfare, and it just really looks like the um, BAL for just like a submachine class. Um, so basically what I have on it is rapid fire just for faster shooting. Plus it bumps up the fire rate. Um, extended mags uh, that really helps with keeping or maintaining like ammo and stuff. Uh, basically, I have scavenger and lightweight on just to move faster. Scavenger just to collect ammo if I'm running out of ammo. Engineer is to see through or you can see through the walls of like enemy equipment and all that. Dead silence so they can't hear. Now this is really good too right here. Stim shot. You can uh, use this often i think every every actually every time you get shot and your health is low you can always immediately use it so i mean this is probably one of the best things to use too now i do have primary gunfighter just for this or just for the, um another attachment but i'm 10 out of 10 up here um the only reason i had that on was uh for search and destroy but uh perk 2 greed i put on lightweight just for that faster movement when i'm rushing and stuff um Another gun that's really good is Spitfire. I'm pretty sure everybody knows this is probably like the second best or maybe the first best uh, submachine gun out there. It's basically the Scorpion from Black Ops 2. So what I have is this sight right here on it, the Tritium sight. I got the quick draw just for faster aiming, extended mags, which are just more ammo and stock when I'm uh, like moving left and right and stuff it's way faster. Stim shot again, very OP. You can use it like right when you get shot. Primary gunfighter, just for all these attachments that make this gun like very good. And this gun doesn't bounce as much with all these attachments on it, just because they got quick draw and extended mags. Extended mags almost acts like a grip, just because the way your character holds it. Um, I do have engineer on again, scavenger, and this time I have ghost on, just uh, for any uh, like UAVs or any of that like. Uh, the enemies pop up so this is my spitfire clash right here very op and then uh let's go back to the cordite real quick uh the rapid fire and extended mag so that's for the cordite there and then um gks now when i first started playing this game um i didn't have the suppressor on it this is i thought this gun was going to be like the best submachine gun until i i played with the cordite and all that but um, honestly, this is like one of the best submachine guns to use uh, for rushing or like I, I use it a lot in search and destroy. I just put the suppressor on it and it like acts like it's literally one of the best guns in the game. So suppressor, quick draw for faster aiming, extended mags for more ammo. Uh, the primary gunfighter again, they have all those attachments, stem shot, engineer, scavenger, and ghost. Actually, I want to change this to dead silence. Um, honestly, this is one of the best guns if not okay so here actually matter of fact let me rate these so in my opinion cordite would be first spitfire would be second and then the gks would be third honestly it's just one of those guns that you can just go off it's literally like the uh mk or the mp5 from like any other call of duty um now for assault rifles you guys can see uh the vapor it's not bad um I do recommend putting on rapid fire just that faster fire rate for an assault rifle because assault rifles usually uh, just shoot at a moderate speed but when you have rapid fire it's way better especially with stock too. Um, same same perks go on stim shot everything else is the same. Um, ICR is probably one of the best guns on here too I got a reflex sight instead of uh, instead of like any of these I don't know I think these are more of just like people who sit back and camp like kind of scopes. 
um, long barrel for the distance shooters, uh, quick draw and AP rounds to melt down shields. Uh, again, same thing with perks and uh, gear. Um, and then the last AR, which is my favorite AR, it's basically the Scar. Um, if you take away uh, this right here, oh crap, if you take away this right here and all those attachments on the back of it, it's basically the Scar. You can see at the upper, it's a Scar. Um, the Rampart 17 is honestly the best. You don't need a scope for it at all. The iron sights are probably like the best sights on the game. Um, I have a grip, AP rounds, and fast mags. Fast mags is basically um, just you reload faster. That's about it. Uh, scavenger, because I know this gun sometimes runs out of ammo. I think it's three clips on this one, I believe. Yeah, three mags. Uh, and I, it said, what, 30? Yeah, 30 rounds of mag, so... Um, yeah, again, same perks and all that. This is one of the best ARs in my opinion. So this is my number one AR that I use right here. And then my number one submachine gun is right here that I use, the Cordite. So, I mean, basically, if you guys just follow through with those gun setups and, like, the class setups and all that, you guys are going to be, like, smacking every single kid on this game because everybody sucks on it. And I dropped 73 freaking million kills last time, so... Alright, I don't know what the heck that was. That's it for this video, guys. If you guys enjoyed it, pre drop a like and subscribe if you guys are new. I will see you guys next week in beta. Um, other than that, guys, peace out.